On the island of Newfoundland Upon the Selwyn's coast Lies the little town of Virgil To whom all things this told There are so many islands That lie just off her shores And when the cold north wind blows You can hear the billows roar The people from the village Make their living from the sea They like their independence it shows that they are free Some fish in their small boats In the wind, the rain and sleep While others make their living on the offshore called their fleet They have known their sheer of tragedy Down When the memories overcome, they show their grief with tears. For they have lost some loved ones to the furies of the sea. For heartaches and heartbreaks are locked in memory. This village. It's got beauty carved on its rugged shore. Seven miles of pure white sand. Who could ask for more? The mountains and the valleys where the rivers run so fast. And the salmon rides to the sportsman's fly as he makes another cast Tell the people of this village love their native home for anyone who goes away oh surely will return just like that life Rugged bellies burn so deeply in your soul. What makes this rugged bellies burn so deeply in your soul? Good evening, and welcome to this week in review. Tonight in our stories, we have Walk of Lights, New Car Winner. Please stay tuned for these stories after this. Being prepared to carry out a search and rescue mission at a moment's notice takes dedication, determination, and know-how. Canadian Coast Guard Auxiliary Volunteers train hard to be ready when the call comes. They have to. They take on over 1,800 rescue missions each year and save hundreds of lives. Support the Canadian Coast Guard Auxiliary Saving lives for 30 years. The Girl Guides held a walk of lights on Saturday, December the 6th, to commemorate a National Day of Remembrance. The walk was in memory of 14 women who were killed in Quebec because they were taking a welding course, which the gunmen believed was a man's job. Brownie leader Paulette Ann read out some information along with the names of those who were killed. ...on violence against women. Girl Guides of Canada is challenging all its members to join together to commemorate this important day. The Purple Ribbon Campaign Against Violence was initiated by the Advisory Council on the Stratus of Women Polytechnique and to raise awareness, awareness about violence. We urge our members to wear the Purple Ribbon on December 6th as, as our way of showing solidarity with all girls and women and our commitment to ending violence against them. And the 14 women were, I don't know if you've ever names, but. Genevieve Bergeron, 
Born. Her big birthday. Born 1968. Helen Colgan, born 1966. Natalie Croteau, 1966. Barbara Dagno, 1967. Anne Marie Edward, 1968. Maude Havernick, 1960. Maurice Laganiere, 1964. Maurice Leclerc, 1966. Anne Marie LeMay, 1967. Sonia Pelletier, 1961. Michelle Richard, 1968. Anne, Anne St. Arnaud, 1966. Hanny Turcotte, 1969. And Barbara Klutznik Wijewicz, 1958. The walk began at the parish hall. The RCMP escorted the walkers to the community center basement. After everyone had arrived, hot chocolate with marshmallows were served. Thanks to all those who came out and supported the walk. Wesley and Cody are members of the War Amps Champ Program. Wesley lost his hand in a machinery accident when he was three years old. One day, while Cody was playing, he fell into the path of a riding lawnmower and lost his leg below the knee. So you said that this would be... As they grow up, the War Amps will be there, providing support every step of the way. Today, Wesley and Cody are safety ambassadors. Wesley gives play safe presentations at schools. I'm here to teach you about playing safe. Cody rides on board the War Amps Play Safe float. Wesley and Cody have a message for all kids. Spot the danger before you play. Play, play safe. safe. Play safe. Ada Walsh was the lucky winner of a new 2009 Ford Focus. Her name was entered into a draw along with four other names that was sent to Nova Scotia 
where names from all Foodland stores across Newfoundland were entered. Off camera, Ada said that she was out of town when she got the news, but was very excited. Sometimes she could not believe that the car was actually hers and had to look in the driveway to make sure that she wasn't dreaming. Gord Ingram, owner and operator of Ingram's Roomland, officially presented Ada with her car on Tuesday morning. Her family was with her as she accepted her prize. Congratulations, Ada. Okay, Ada, congratulations on winning the uh, 2009 Ford Fusion. Uh, and Ada's the winner of the promotion that we had for the uh, car promotion. Uh, started back about uh, six, seven weeks ago. We had a five week promotion. And every week a customer won $100 and, that, and plus names went in to win the car. And the, uh, all the ballots were sent to Stellarton, Nova Scotia. And that's all the ballots from Newfoundland. And uh, when they did the draw, Ada was the lucky winner. <laughs> so anyway, again, congratulations, safe driving. And thanks very much. It was a great promotion for the store. And uh, thanks for, uh, well, what can I say? I guess uh, when you shop at Poolland, you're a winner. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Thank thanks you very, very much. much. Yeah, congratulations to <laughs> you guys too. Thank you. Uh, yeah, and, uh, Maxine, yeah, this was uh, quite a promotion. Uh, last year, uh, it gave us a real nice, when we had a car for sale last year, or a car on, uh, on tickets last year, uh, all the Foodland stores had great uh, increase in sales, and uh, the car was one in Fogo, uh, on Fogo Island. So this year, the promotion went over extra. Uh, this year, uh, exceeded the what the uh, Foodland and Sobeys people had expected. So thanks to all the customers, uh, congratulations to the winners that won the $100 gift certificates, and thanks to everybody that shop here. And again, Ada, congratulations. Thanks very much. Thank again, you. Congratulations. Thank you very much. This concludes our programming for tonight. Please stay tuned for the 2008 Christmas show. Thank you for watching. Good night. Thank you.